Welcome back to Eateries, this is week 166, day 1, beginning of Astra Anima season as well as Water and Wind season and we're just gonna jump straight into the match because we have 6 minutes. So I guess I can show you the teams that I can show you the teams really quickly. So bonus unit is going to be Altina. She's running the same set in every single team with the flag magic. Uh, this is a Fjorm team with Fjorm and Fjorm. This is a Erika and Corn team. This is a Rioma with Fjorm team. This is the Emerin Fjorm uh, Mer team. And this is the double damage reduction with Mer and uh, Fjorm. All right, let's see what we got. Um, it is Hinoka's bonus week, so I expect to see her. Uh, you have a rally. You have a rally that goes right here. Then do you have aerobatics? You have aerobatics to go right here. Uh, yeah. Um, do we just double save this? I think we just double save this. I mean, this is probably the most annoying thing, but she's not going to do anything because she won't be able to go first. It's going to be a little annoying, though, to keep her for last. That would be annoying to keep her for last. Because Nana will die if she attacks. Who knows? Maybe Nana will not attack. But yeah, we'll go with this team. By these twin blades. We'll just double save. Yeah. Um, you guys need to be here. I guess if I put you two here. I guess I can put you all the way, both over here, by doing something like this. One, two, three, four. But where will flame go to maximize my... Mm, I guess if we go that way it's a little bad. I won't be able to maximize flame. So, so, I think the square, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, and then Altina can be on the side, I guess. And yeah, there's no dancer, so it's got. It would be a little hard to like try to block Luis. Forty-five, fifty-three. I mean, uh, I guess I could just like try to slow her down by just leaving Murd by herself and everybody within range of Fjorm, so she would just target uh, Murd while I go and get the Ether. All right. Over here. So put you here. Put you here. Put you here. One, two, three. Of One, course. Yes. Two, I won't three. Have some put you here. Reposition you here and put you right here. And everybody will be in safe. And then, yeah, we'll do that. Yeah. Understood. Explain. Away we go! You have my trust. Consider it done. Yes? Alright. Burning pretty fast. Yeah! 
this burning not as fast even if i die oh i forgot that she's i was leveling her up well leveling her summoner support so i forgot to give her mirror strike All right, there's Mer, brand new and improved. Also, why doesn't Otto have his special? I've got a trick for you. Mm, I don't know, I didn't check, but he didn't have his special, so. Twenty six is exactly fifty two, but. Didn't matter. All right, so I could block Bernie and force everybody into because if I block over here, then uh, I have to put Fiorm here? right here. So she can save, but at the same time keep a uh, Bernie trap. And that is possible if I do it how? Mer has to get out of the way. So we can kill Luis. Yeah. So it'll be like hit right here and come back right here. It does the real trap, it's three spaces, so one, two, three, it hits where Mer is, but it does not hit Fjorm. Um, I can move... I need to move Fjorm over here, which means move Mer one up, and then swap with Fjorm. Move uh, yes. Niffle over here, Fjorm will be over here. here. And then with I can reposition Mer with Altina. As long as nobody is in range of Bernie, Bernie will not be able to um, attack anybody. And Luis can only attack Fjorm. So let's yeah. do that. Take a mirror. Come back right here. Like I said, Fjorm is safe. Time for tricks. Yes. Have some tricks. Move you right here. I'll protect you. And reposition. It is decided. Move you over here. Consider it done. And get you out of the way. Cool. Everybody's within Fjorm's safe range. have to do is just go get the ether. You have my trust. Understood. Next Over turn here? I can go I won't lose. Uh with Over here? Regan and get this one over here. And get this one with Niffle. Since it is Altina's bonus week, we'll let Altina have the last hit. Yeah. Ah, that was pretty simple. Double save is just... I don't know, as... When they want to force you to play double save, then like, you really don't have much. And like I said, it already turns to the next day.
So now we can take a look at those replays and if you notice we did lose points plus we don't have the bonus mythic this week so we have three matches the first one we only defeated one which means it counted as if we had if we had the bonus mythic and didn't kill anybody this one we lose two and this one they beat us completely so this is the bonus team this week i mean the defensive this week we have Seros with the flag missile Tracier with her miracle attack speed solo set gun try to provide debuffs and she doesn't have a shield so i guess i'll fix that ike not running this encounter this week running the flag magic and steady breath though Leaf, Mystic Boost, Astrid with Attack Speed Bond because I mean she already has Bond in her A slot so might as well. The only other thing I still haven't given her a better C slot and Kines, Kid Ines over here. Meanwhile they brought in an Altina plus 3 bonus unit. Also running the reposition deflect magic set. Brad of Yorn plus two. Uh, basically li literally the exact same one uh, set I have on mine. Near say Burger King with double close defense. Plumeria plus two with guidance, HP rest. Okay. Regan double switch pair reposition. And finally Plus 5, plus 10, Summoner supported Micaiah with Reposition, Glimmer, Mirror Stance, Null Seed, Pole Smoke, and Distant Defense. As the, acting as the frontliner to the, the Burger King's uh, near safe. This is actually pretty close because she did one less point of damage. It would be 46 now. Technically, she's still what I got in it because we only have 42 health. Here, the only thing I might have to get rid of Tracier's reposition so this doesn't happen. She doesn't put herself as a frontliner. There they had to move Yorn so they could no longer try to isolate uh, Astrid. Take a leaf because of the um, her pulse smoke. He didn't he didn't have his um, special ready. Well, he wouldn't have been able to write that with the special. There they, I don't know why they step on the trap, but they underestimated Astrid. Remember, she has the bond uh, attack speed on her so know your place yeah thanks to black luna the burger king still does a lot of damage And unfortunately for them, I goes after Altina, which does have Twin Blades, so they were not able to get both pots. Then we have Arion. Uh, 
uh, plus one Regan with reposition death blow. Naga plus eight with double fear reposition and blazing flame. Altina plus one, smite wings of mercy distant defense. Corin and unmerged Corin somewhere supported with Fjorm. I mean, like, I guess this does something, but it's pretty, it's pretty budget. Uh, Plumeria, Dry Defense, Wings of Mercy. And Fjorm, plus two, plus two, with Kestrel Stance in reposition. Attack smoke as well. So first goes Ike. And yeah, put Ice Mirror. We do enough damage that she kills us in return. And because Fior nullifies debuffs, Gunther is not very effective against her. Here they have to back away. And yeah, unfortunately, this is not a very, very invested Fjorm, so. And it actually survives this, so. Yeah, from here, they're, this is why they lose a second unit. They're really kind of trapped. And they gamble that trap right there just to take out Astrid because Astrid would definitely have killed at least two of the units one of two of their units should I say here's mostly the boss from um, Naga I mean from not Naga from Seiros that he's getting all those plus nine to all stats Yeah, when a corn is getting double by an Ike, you know that you really should at least put some other stuff on him. Save by the damage reduction. This actually did 34 damage. I was actually surprised that. Here's pretty much Wings of Mercy. What allows him to get this Ether over here. Yeah, that's a win, but with a two-unit loss, so. And finally, we have this one. Regan, Double Swiss Sparrow. Naga, Fury, Chills, uh, even Attack Wave, Reposition Glimmer. Altina, Reposition Fear Stance. Duo Hilda, or Summer Hilda, Attack Speed Solo Miracle, 
Ninja Lane, plus one plus nine, Death Blow, Disarm Trap, Reposition, and Duo Tiki. So they brought down all their duos over here. Reposition, Attack Rest, Slink, God Flyers, and Drive Attack. I mean, I guess I could have like substituted Guntra for uh, a duo unit of my own, but like I said, just don't try to be too annoying with my teams. Make them nice, simple, and straightforward. And there they know that that's the last trap is the real trap, so waited for Bolt Tower. I don't think so. This time because Ines is not by himself, so yeah. he doesn't get uh, his solo, so Regan is able to double him. I think that was exact damage right there, but it wouldn't have mattered because she can quad. We has, she has the flag missile, so that's why. Which at this point, I really wish I had this encounter on her. Pretty easy to clear. Summer Hilda, strong enough, fast enough. Go for it. You're finished. And all they gotta do is just avoid leave for one turn and they'll be able to get uh, the second pot. I think they use all of their um, dual skills, all three of them. What was her again? I don't even remember what it does. Uh, isolation, that's right. Yep, yeah, that's pretty much that. So I think there is like one banner to summon on. So let's do that. Yeah, the new heroes banner, the new power banner, I guess. Um, we'll go red for Mer, or green for Corin, since there's actually nobody in colorless. Sheena. And that's pretty much it. Um, see how you guys did on day one and we'll call it a day. All right, and we got Ukiso in first place, ECLA, Promise, Matt, Logan, Kako. A lot of people play multiple matches in the first day. Kenny, Neo Sourceman, Dark Cluster, Lambras, Oron, Brave Blitz, Michael, Diego, Dogs, Silver, Eva, 
Brandy and Beam and Allen. I think that is everybody. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye.